guys, guys, it's paint time. Okay, I've been doing some, some a whole lot of trimming and uh, done a whole lot of sanding and stuff. And I'm going to show you what, give you a walkthrough, what it's like just before I paint. So go and check this out. All right, so I won't spend much time out here because it's windy and it'll probably be picking up all the wind here. So these are the uh, outside stairs to go in. They just fold up and just throw in when I'm driving. They're, they're pretty good. This is more of a, a heavy duty gorilla uh, step ladder. Pretty happy with that. And this is the platform ladder. It's got a bit of a wobble. I need to do some cross bracing, but yeah, pretty happy with that. But let's have a look inside. I think you're gonna I think you're gonna like this. Okay, so last time you saw the video when I was actually out there camping and I had crap everywhere. Uh, you couldn't really see how everything was. So let's have a look here. Look, all of the, the quad trimming I've, I've done all through here. My skills aren't all that good, but it's gonna come up pretty good. I've uh, I've puttied up all of the, the screw holes there because some people have said that the putty's gonna fall out so hopefully i haven't stuffed up too much there but uh yeah i've done a whole lot of quad 12 mil quad all on the the top and the sides and down below on the floor i've got a 19 mil quad down through there so it'll it'll come up pretty good uh what else we got i'll, I'll show you guys the, the the water system i've got here i've shown you in the past but now with all everything out of the way, we can have a look. We've got the, the 425 litre drums. They're all just plumbed together. They come in from the outside through there. And there's the pump. Now, it's an agricultural grade pump. Uh, I actually had to put a pressure reducer uh, valve there, that big blue thing there. Um, some people messaged me about using just normal, normal uh, garden hose saying, oh, it's, it's not good for you. And I said, well, to be honest, I actually, I'm not going to be drinking out of this. This is purely for uh, for washing up the dishes, uh, cleaning cleaning your hands and whatever, and showering. So not not too worried about that. But so that's that's, that's pretty much the, the plumbing system. Pretty happy with all of that. I've shown you guys the electrics in the past. It's all pretty good. Uh, I'm happy with the whole thing. The only thing I need to do now is... I'm going to mount a solar panel on the roof and put the uh, the controlling unit just here to bring in the solar from, from up there. And uh, yeah, I'll see how we go with that. But as you can see, guys, there's heaps of room in here. This is where the, the couch goes. Um, so it just it, it fits there perfectly. Um, here we just have a bit of storage. And I've got all of the, the storage up here. So I'm, I'm happy with it all here. And the thing I love up here, up in the, the bed area, is all of this storage we've got either side of the bed. Right, all the way along. It's uh, it's bloody brilliant. So I'm loving this. Uh, yeah, you don't don't want to look too close to uh, to my skills up there, but a bit of paint will will fix it all up. And to be honest, this is just a a homemade camper. I'm not selling this bastard, so I'm pretty happy with the whole thing. But uh, you know, got the got the door door trims there, and yeah. So next step now is uh, is prepping up for the paint, and then get a get the spray gun out and give everything a big old undercoat, and see how I go with the undercoat. Then yeah, see how thirsty this is. I think the plywood's going to be pretty thirsty with the paint, so I've got actually a fair bit of undercoat. So yeah. All good. Next video will either be when she's all prepped up or uh, once I've done the undercoat. Cheers, guys. I'll see you later.